Well, now that winter is hopefully in the rear view mirror, our fifth season is underway. Of course, we're talking about road construction. Tonight, we are getting a preview of what local officials are planning for Southeast Minnesota. Our Eric Min is live in North Rochester tonight. Eric, tell us about what the city of Rochester is planning and what do drivers need to know to be ready for construction season. Brock and Caitlin, city, city of Rochester says it has four street projects lined up for this year. So right where I'm standing is a is where like one of the street projects is going to be. So I am currently on North Broadway Avenue and near its intersection with Elton Hills Drive Northwest. So this is where the city will be working on the roadway between Silver Lake Bridge and Elton Hills Drive. This is just one example of the many construction projects this year that the city says will improve safety and transportation. City of Rochester Public Works Director Tyler Niemeyer tells me this year's projects will bring many safety improvements but will also impact neighborhoods and traffic. To plan ahead, he suggests residents take advantage of the city's construction impact map and public project dashboard on its website. Both of those resources are available for people to go on and check out hopefully ahead of your trip to see what impacts might be occurring within the city um, and how you can potentially reroute around projects or um, look at detour routes or what you might anticipate as you encounter those projects. For this year, MnDOT says it has currently two dozen projects in line, all of which are planned to keep its highways and interstates in shape for driver safety and ease. And these are safety improvements that we have as well as, you know, a mixture of preserving our pavements and other things so that we have, you know, good driving surfaces and, and bridges that are in good condition for the traveling public. Olmsted County Transportation Construction Manager Scott Holmes says this year's winter was unusual and it seemed like construction season should have started earlier. The winter was really not a winter, so it kind of felt like season should have started earlier, but yeah, we're finally getting into it kind of like normally. April 15th is kind of our kickoff date for construction, and yeah, we've got some projects starting up, so hopefully it's going to be a great year. MnDOT spokesperson Michael Doherty advises everyone to slow down and be careful near road work for everyone to be safe. You know, it might be frustrating for you as a driver um, that you're slowed down or you're stopped, um, but doing something that's risky, um, that could affect their lives, all that work gets done by people. Real human beings with lives, you know, they go home each night to families, If you're interested in learning about all of these construction projects that are taking place this year by the Minnesota Department of Transportation, Olmsted County, and City of Rochester, visit all of our links at, in our web story at k2dc.com. We will have resources that lead you to maps and more details about each and every one of those projects. Live in Rochester, Eric Min, k2dc News. A busy season ahead, Eric. Thank you.